Today I'm going to show you an armor plate script created by this person. As the name suggests, it replaces the traditional method of applying armor with a more dynamic system allowing players to insert plates into a vest. I'll leave a link to the resource and creator's preview in the description. I hope you enjoy the video. First, click the link in the description that takes you to the resource. Before we get started, the dependencies are one of these frameworks in Oxlib, so make sure you have them. Then click the green code and download zip. Once it's done, open it up and open your server resources and add it in. Then remove the dash main from the end. Then go to your server config and ensure it. The next thing to do is add the items to go back to the readme on GitHub. And the items are separated based on what you use. I'm using aux inventory, so I'll copy these. If you aren't, scroll and copy the QB items. There's a path that tells you where to put them if you don't know where to go. So I'll go to aux inventory. Into the data folder. And into the item section. And paste what was copied. The next thing to do is add the images. So go back to the resource folder, into the images folder, and copy what's inside. Then you need to add them to your inventory. There's a path in the README as well if you don't know where to go. For aux inventory, it's in the web folder, images, and then paste. The last thing to look at is the config, so go back to the resource folder once more, and open it up. The first thing in here, options for the plates, is separated into civilian or criminal and police. In each you have the item name, how much the armor increases when a plate is added, the max amount of armor, how long it takes, and the required jobs. The last thing is the name of the required vest. If you made changes, be sure to save them, then start your server and test it out. If this video was helpful, consider supporting my work by ordering a VPS or transferring your current one of one of one servers using the link below. Created by the team behind Project Sloth, one of one service is a top VPS provider for popular 5M servers delivering unmatched uptime and performance. They offer the best DDoS protection, super fast 10 gigabit per second internet speed, and exceptional support via Discord and tickets with 96% of tickets answered in under 30 minutes. With locations in Dallas, Ashburn, Chicago, and Europe, they ensure low latency and top tier reliability. So I have the armor vests in both types of plates. I don't have the police shop, so I won't be able to use those. So I'll start with the criminal ones instead. So you use the plate and it's applying it and the armor increases. So I'll keep doing that until I reach the max. And if you try to go above that, it won't let you. It'll tell you that the maximum armor capacity has been reached. All right, I have the police job now, so I'll go ahead and use the police armor plates. Same type of thing. The only difference is it allows you to have more armor, which you can change in the config. So it's full. And again, if I try it, it's not going to let me because I have the maximum amount. That'll be all for this video. If you enjoyed and it helped you out, please leave a like and a sub. If you need help or have any suggestions, feel free to comment down below or join my Discord. The link will be in the description. Thank you for watching.